Hi, welcome to ICPS. Uh, today I'm going to highlight about civil engineering. So most of the learners are asking about the civil engineering qualifications. So now we have the qualification from Procol. Procol is UK based awarding body. That is the number one awarding body. So offering Procol level six diploma in civil engineering and Procol level seven diploma in civil engineering. Most importantly, the qualification is of course regulated, which means it can lead you to job and even for the studies. Like if you want to get the level seven, still available and if you go on to get to the masters in civil engineering still options are available in the global universities so this is the best time and the best option for the technical staffs for the civil engineers for the project managers uh, just uh, come to us and get this qualification so the qualification uh, procol level 6 in civil engineering is designed for the learners like for the experienced professionals working in the civil industry also for the project managers who are working uh, uh, in the civil industry for the top managers for the technical staff members, for the engineers aspiring for the senior roles, they are interested to get the senior roles in the civil industry. So the qualification is going to help them to boost their career. Uh, also for the construction managers who are working in the civil industry and now they are uh, like looking to improve their uh, capacity related to the civil engineering. And this qualification is going to add the value, uh, value related to the theory and value related to the technical support that they can get the qualification with the help of the evidences so this is going to uh, improve their career and definitely it is going to add a great value to their academic career now i will talk about the eligibility criteria for this qualification so anyone who have completed the 12th grade or bae diploma for associate engineering and they are working in the industry having two uh, one two or three years of experience in the civil industry and they can easily provide the evidences so they can get the uh, qualification so this qualification is going to equip them that they are having a degree that is in civil engineering uh, and even this qualification is for the experienced learner they don't have any sort of degree they don't have DAE so uh, still they are eligible for this qualification based on their experience and based on their expertise so how we can entertain them we can just uh, get some uh, knowledge test with them and we can conduct the professional discussions with them in that we just have to assess we just have to assure that they have the uh, enough knowledge about the industry about the uh, like procedures protocols related to civil engineering and in this way they can get the diploma so the six mandatory units for this qualification are advanced serving techniques estimation and caustic in construction structural design and analysis structure drawing and drafting construction project management building materials and construction technology so these are the six units that you need to complete in order to get this qualification so one by one you need to complete the qualif uh, unit you have to prepare the assignments you have to align the evidences and then you have to upload one by one so each unit will be assessed by the assessor if it is good it is satisfied it is satisfactory then you can move towards the next unit so this will be the whole process for the all of the units and in this way you can complete your qualification fee structure for this qualification is 1100 usd dollars or you can say 3 lakhs Pakistani rupees or if you want to convert in Saudi Riyal Dirham that will be about uh, 40 Saudi Riyal or Dirham you can convert according to your currency according to your local uh, currency uh, if I have to talk about the duration of this qualification that is about 6 to 8 months it totally depends on the learner that how uh, frequently the learner is like investing the time he is deploying uh, himself he is like uh, preparing the assignments he is creating the evidences so whatsoever the time that you can allocate this qualification uh, rapidly you can get the outcome of this qualification and if i'm talking about uh, the icps icps is an approved satellite center with ict inspire college of technologies that is an approved training center with the procol qualifications so this qualification uh, uh, will be offered by icps and we're going to facilitate you in terms of our assessor we have an approved assessor for this qualification he is going to engage you he is going to induct you uh, uh, induction session will be provided he is going to support you in order to prepare the evidences how to align the evidences how to make the submissions uh, if there is a resubmission how to rework how to re-attack the things so everything will be from our side and definitely uh, you would like our support and our support assessors uh, feedback definitely it is going to help you so that you can get the qualification in time following are some of the categories for uh, some of the designations in which you can easily get the job opportunity after this qualification are architectural technologist building services engineer construction manager engineering geologist fire risk assessor 
so these are the multiple options by which you can easily attain a good opportunity a good title a good designation uh, in the global uh, competitive environment basically the qualification is uk based and of course regulated qualification so if you are interested to work in U europe in uk in gulf dubai qatar oman so the qualification is globally acceptable even if you want to study then you can easily go towards the level 7 diploma and that will lead you to top up masters and even after the level 6 diploma you can get the direct entry into the complete masters program so a lot of options are there after this qualification so if you are struggling to get the promotions if you are struggling to get the good title in civil engineering so this qualification is going to change the whole scenario of your career now moving towards the level 7 in civil engineering so that will be a sort of progression route after level 6 you can go towards the level 7 or you can go towards the master program but after level 6 if you are going towards the masters that will be complete or full master degree but if a few going towards the masters after level 7 that will be top of masters because level 7 diploma consists of 120 credits with a 1200 qualification time 600 guided learning hours so this qualification is going to cover 120 credits 120 credits are uh, approximately about 66% portion of the master program so you only needs to complete 60 credits from the university in order to get the top up master's program but still this is a post graduate diploma even if you are not interested to convert it into the degree still it is uh, acceptable in the job is it is acceptable uh, in the global competitive market so you can get a good designation a good title a good opportunity as a civil or project manager duration for this qualification is about 6 to 8 months again it will depend on the learner how uh, he is investing time and allocating time for this qualification the qualification is assignment based that needs evidences so everything that you needs to compile you needs to submit if it is good if it is satisfactory so that it will be assessed by the assessor initially for the unit number 1 2 and 3 up to all of the units once your portal is 100% from the learner and from the assessor then it will be forwarded to the iq internal quality assurance you need to check out the work from the learner and also will work from the assessor once iq is done he will forward things to the iq if everyone is satisfied like this is going to be assessed at three different stages assessor side iq side and the iq side if everything is clear and everything is satisfied then you can complete your diploma in about 6 to 8 months fee structure is uh, about 3 lakh 70 thousand pakistani rupees if you want to convert in the um, usd dollars that will be about uh, 1300 around and if i'm talking about uh, saudi riyal or dirham that will be around 5000 saudi riyal or dirham so you can convert according to your currency according to your local exchange rate for more information or registration you can contact us the link is there of our website uh, on the screen and even in the description of the video so you can find us uh, you can contact us for the registration for the more uh, information and uh, hopefully you will be satisfied and this qualification is going to change your career thank you very much